Hello friends. Welcome back to Nutrizen. Shape it up. Yoga is a systematic practice of physical exercise, breath control, relaxation, diet control, positive thinking and meditation aimed at developing harmony in the body, mind, and environment. On Nutrizen we will be covering beginner to advanced yoga practices. Please like share and subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon, so that you get notification, whenever we post a new video. Well, without wasting any more time let's get into the video now. Let's start Virabhadrasana 1, which is also known as Warrior 1 Pose. Virabhadrasana or Warrior Pose is a group of related lunging standing asanas or yoga poses. The asana is pronounced as Virabhadra Asana. Warrior Pose 1 is one of the three warrior poses that beautifully combines both the standing and balancing actions of the body. Level, Beginners, Style, Vinyasa Yoga, Duration, 20 seconds on each leg, Repetitions, 1, Strengthens, Ankle Thighs Shoulders Calves Arms Back, Stretches, Ankles Navel Groin, Thighs Shoulders Lungs, Calves Thorax Neck. Benefits This asana is known to strengthen and tone the lower back, the arms, and the legs. It helps to stabilize and balance the body as it increases the stamina. It is also a great asana for those with desk or sedentary jobs. It stimulates the metabolism as well as restores the spine. This asana relaxes the mind and the body spreading the notion of peace, courage, grace, and a sense of auspiciousness. It also helps release stress from the shoulders almost immediately. This asana helps ease out frozen shoulders. Now let's see how to perform. From a plank position, raise your hips up toward the ceiling so your body is in an inverted V shape. This is down dog. Step your right foot between your hands. If it doesn't make it, use your hands to place it there. Angle your left foot out. Reach your arms over your head with your palms facing each other. Look up slightly. Pull your left thigh forward to square your hips. Imagine your hips are headlights. Both should point forward. Take a few deep breaths. Then repeat the pose on the opposite side. Precautions If you have shoulder pains, raise your arms and leave them parallel to each other. Instead of holding them above your head, if you have neck problems, you should not look up at your hands after you stretch them. If you suffer from knee pain or have arthritis, you can use the support of a wall to do this asana. Pregnant women will benefit from this asana, especially if they are in their second and third trimester. But with a doctor's permission, people suffering from heart problems or high blood pressure should avoid this asana. Still have doubts? Comments below. Hope you have found our content informative. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.